Good morning, afternoon, evening, fabulites. Fabulous day. It's March 2nd, 2017. I have looked at my news feed, but nothing is jumping out at me in terms of anything exciting or interesting happening outside of my personal world this morning. I did see and hear about um, the fact that uh, Jeff Sessions, Jefferson Sessions, the Attorney General of the United States, appointed by number 45 has had some contact apparently or allegedly with the Russians and during his confirmation hearing he was specifically asked have you had any contact with the Russians he's like no I had no contact with the Russians and now I don't I, did, I don't know the details but apparently something is coming out so it's again just very shocking and surprising um, that politicians and particularly these politicians and business people and um, uh, capitalist exploiters are liars. <laughs> no. Um, and thinking a little bit about death today, I have personally not experienced the transition of anyone close to me. My uncle made his transition. As a child, I was felt close to him. He was my father's relative that I felt closest to that I can remember and his children. But I can't say that I feel that I have um, had a close relationship with him. But God rest his soul. Um, God rest my cousin um, Connie's soul um, and all of the folks who've made their transition that I know of um, that are connected with me relatively close to me over the past month I think of death in a very abstract way and I feel very peaceful with people making their transitions I feel that death is a part of life and I try to live in such a way that I can be at peace with death however and whenever it comes um, to me directly or to someone that I care about. But again, that's abstract because I don't know how I'm going to feel when I actually personally have the experience of someone close to me making their transition. And the other thing that's on my mind is I went to Catholic school. So the last time that I was at a Catholic wedding, not a Catholic funeral, which was my very first Catholic funeral, I was surprised that a lot of things that had been ingrained in me going to Mass as a child, we went once a week when I went to St. Benedict's uh, Catholic School, we went to Mass once a week, and when I was at the burial, the funeral Mass, there were a lot of things that just sort of came back to me, and I was shocked that I had black Catholics in my family, I grew up Baptist, I thought all black folks were Baptists. Um, or grew up Baptist. I don't consider myself Baptist now um, necessarily, but I love God. I believe in God, but I'm not really a part of any structured, organized religion. Um, so I'm coming to a, a, a funeral for one of my cousins who is Catholic um, today. So um, this sounds really weird, but the last time I, I'm excited about the frankincense. Are they going to have frankincense and myrrh? Because I was sort of shocked like wait a second this is frankincense and myrrh I know this from another context so that's what's going on with me today um what is what are your thoughts about death um what are your thoughts about religion do you know any black catholics do you know this is my second black catholic I mean funeral so I know black catholics and I knew some when I was in Hattiesburg Mississippi too so have a fabulous day be you be fabulous. Be fabulous you. <laughs> Bye.